Hello! Welcome to Cooking with Random! <laughs> Just complaining, y'all. What's up, everybody? So, today I'm gonna be making a homemade enchilada. Hello! I'm making homemade enchiladas, uh, homemade enchilada casserole, and uh, Mexican rice. So, right now I'm starting with the Mexican rice, y'all. Okay? So, I have one cup of rice and I have the pot with a little bit of oil. So what I'm going to do is just, just let it toast, let it toasty toast. Hope everybody's doing I right today. You guys can see it. Yes. Yeah, so you just want to toast it really good until it's like a little brown. Just really toasty. I have it right now on like medium heat. Yeah, I hope you guys can see me. How's the lighting, y'all? Uh... So I'm just gonna let it toast, okay? So it's nice and toasty now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to be adding some tomato sauce. A whole can, like a, a eight ounce can of tomato sauce, whatever you're pick, picking, whatever floats your boat. Yes, yes. Steer, 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 steer. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And now I'm gonna be adding two cups of water. Mm hmm. Steer, yeah. Nice and steery. Okay. It's going to bring it up to a bubble. A boil. Toys of trouble. Yeah, this really smells bomb. Okay, so what I'm going to add is some black pepper. It, these ingredients I'm going to add right now are all to your tasting. I like to add a buttload of black pepper. I'm going to be adding some chicken bouillon. This is a good kind. I'm going to use the last of it. <laughs> Some garlic salt. Some, a little bit of garlic powder. It's a steer. So there's not a certain amount that I put, you all It's just whatever is to your tasting, whatever you feel like putting. And then what you're going to do is just let it boil. And then you're going to cover it for like 20, 20 minutes. Look, y'all. Look, y'all. I'm gonna add a little black pepper. Mm 
you're probably thinking, damn boy, it's a lot of damn black pepper. Yes, this needs flavorings. This needs good flavorings, y'all. Woo-wee! Alright, y'all, and it is done. You know what? A little bit more garlic salt. Stirry, stirry, stirry. <laughs> y'all, this is gonna have good flavor. I promise y'all. And then, cover it, lower the heat. And you got Mexican rice, y'all. Random style. All right, be back, y'all. Okay, what is up, y'all? So right now, I'm just grinding some beef. Some good ground beef, lean beef. I season it with like pepper, garlic, salt. And then if you can see in the back, I got my enchilada sauce warming up right now. Oh, these smells so bomb in here, you guys. I'm going to just drain this and put a little bit of olives. I use olives, y'all. Yes. Um, what I meant to tell y'all is that you guys could also add like onion. I just forgot onion. Um, so adding onion, just making your own thing. This is what I do. I like to keep it simple. Oh, and this is the enchilada sauce I use. I know who made because I'm not at that stage yet. All right, y'all. So I'm gonna just go ahead and. Finish this up here, and I'll be back with y'all, okay? Okay, y'all, so it's done. I assembled it, so now I'm going to just put it in the oven at 350 for a good hour. And there you have it. Enchilada casserole, y'all. All right, y'all. Catch you in a bit. Peace. What up, my rat fam? So I'm back. And guess what I made, y'all? So, look at y'all. So, it is the finished product. I got my Mexican rice. Got my enchilada casserole, y'all. Look at this. And it got me a little greenery. Got me the salad. And, y'all, I'm using this salad dressing. Yes, yes. All right, y'all. So get started grab your food and also remember to thumbs up this video Ooh -wee! this is gonna be so bomb let's try the Mexican rice y'all mm. mm -hmm. mm. mm -hmm. okay and bite into this bad boy here. Okay, mm. 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 That right there, that right there is the ish. Oh, and not to even pat my own back, but damn, that is so bomb, y'all. So good, it came out so good. Look at that. Mmm, 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 mmm. So, what is up, everybody? What are you guys eating with me? Mmm. And who loves enchilada casserole? Let me know in the comments below what do you guys think of this? Cause look, 
Ja. Mm. So geil. Hope you guys can see me. And I'm having some doc, um, Mountain Dew. Mm. Oh, y'all. Yeah. Oh, y'all. Yeah. Mm. It's like piping hot right out of the oven. And y'all, as you can see, that it didn't take that much time. I mean, it does take some preparation and everything together, but this only took mm -hmm. a good hour and a half. So not that not that much preparation. Not that hard. Mm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm -mm. So good. Mm. So, if y'all don't know, I'm doing a giveaway. So, remember to follow me here. If you haven't yet, to follow me here on YouTube. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. Let me know in your comment. Um, hashtag fam that you are subscribed. And also, y'all, I'm on Instagram now. I am on Instagram. So, it is... The Random Eats, okay? Remember to follow me on Instagram. Send me an e uh, IG message to let me know that you're following me on there as well. Um, yeah, so if we can hit, like I said, if we can hit 500 Instagram followers, 100 subbies here on YouTube, that I will be doing a, a giveaway, okay? I'm gonna be doing a giveaway, but we have to meet those goals. So get your cracking, Ram Fab. And I'm really excited about it. Mm, 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 mm. Everything is so amazing. Yes, sir. Mm. Who just loves a good old cooked meal, homemade cooked meal? Mm. So much better than going to like a, a drive through, going to a fast food place, or even going to a restaurant. You know, all this right here probably costs like what? Less than 20 bucks. His rice is really cheap. The ingredients for the inch um, for the casserole, not that much. You know? Mm-hmm.
Mm-mm-mm. Hope y'all can see my food. <laughs> yeah, I can see it. Mm. So what are you guys up to? Let me know in the comments what are you guys are doing, what are you guys eating with me. Who's ready for Thanksgiving in like four days? I'm going to be working, y'all. <laughs> I'm so bummed out about it. Um, but I'm still having a time to go with friends and family. But yeah, Thanksgiving, I have to work for a couple hours. Who does that? Who works on Thanksgiving? So let me know if you work on Thanksgiving. Please. So I don't feel like alone on this. I just, I did my first smacking. But what are you guys going to be doing for Thanksgiving? This is kind of like my pre-Thanksgiving meal to y'all. gonna make what is your favorite thing about Thanksgiving for me it's just you know just the time with family you know of course the food you know I'm not really a turkey person I'm sorry did I just spit my bad um oh that so good Ooh, ah uh. You know, of course, being with family, but like I said, I'm not really a turkey person. It's good. I really like um, the breast part. Um, the breast is pretty good, and I love the leg. Oh, my God. When I was little, I was at the lake, was running around with the lake. I got the leg. I got the leg. Hitting people and shit with it. <laughs> um, but it was up to me. I'd be making ham, because ham is the shit. Yeah. Who loves ham on Thanksgiving? I do for Thanksgiving, uh, for Christmas. Yes, good old mashed potatoes, homemade mashed potatoes, the gravy, uh, the pineapple sauce on the ham, oh, the Hawaiian rolls, the baked goods, and all that good stuff. So bomb. And let me know in the comments um, if you have like any special traditions, uh, like special things you make, like special gravies, um, things like that. Special dishes, casseroles. Yeah, this is going to be a long ass video. My bad. Hopefully, you guys stay tuned and watch it. <laughs> mm. I've been just craving this for a long time. And you know what, y'all? Yeah? A lot of these things the casserole. Um, the rice I just made on my own. It just really came from memory. A lot of these things are the rice. I just remember my mom making it, how she made it. And the casserole too, the enchilada casserole. Um, you just fill these things out, you know what I mean? Because mm. it's really easy to make. It just takes time to just assemble it and just actually do it.
Yeah, I'm getting full. Damn, I'm getting full. I feel like I talk too much. Do I talk too much, you guys? <laughs> I look talking to y'all, so I talk. It's my bad. Whew. But I can do this. I can finish this. I'm almost done. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It bomb. Got calm now. And it's so good. Like the next day, warmed up. If you haven't tried this, go try it. You know, put your own thing. Like I said earlier, um, you can't add onions. Some people, I want to do it, but some people put um, some beans in it. Mm -mm, I want to do beans. Um, but just make it your own. You know what I mean? Just put your own spin on it. This is how I do. I like to keep it simple. I felt like I was going to burp right now. <laughs> um, but yeah. There we go. <clears throat> but I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you watch it all the way through. This is going to be a long ass video. Um, <laughs> but these things I wanted to show you how I do. Uh, I prepare them and right y'all so remember to thumbs up this video if you can um, if you haven't yet please hit the subscribe button uh, if you're not yet subscribed follow me on Instagram the random eats okay so go follow me so you can be partake of these special um, giveaway I'm gonna be doing okay so until next video, my Ram fam, much love and peace.